10 Signs of Intelligence That Can't Be Faked On this channel, you can find several videos where I talk about intelligence, whether it's in the form of simple IQ, in the form of emotional intelligence, or other types of intelligence categorized in different ways according to the research they're based on. All of us have happened to meet people who at first glance seemed very intelligent, perhaps simply thanks to their ability to use fancy words or quote phrases of famous authors during a conversation, quotes which they probably didn't even fully comprehend the meaning of. There's a difference between sounding smart and actually being smart. And yes, of course, there are different kinds of smarts. We're all smart in our own way and so on and so forth, a bit like the way every baby is beautiful in its mother's eyes, but the reality is slightly different. It's human nature to overestimate oneself. Most of us, including yours truly, probably believe ourselves to be smarter than we actually are. But if this is the case, how can we identify a truly intelligent person without being fooled? In this video, we'll look at 10 signs of intelligence that can hardly be faked. So, let's see what these 10 signs are. Number 1. Great Creativity Innovative ideas and creative solutions are basically everyday practices for highly intelligent people. Creativity is actually one of the highest forms of intelligence because it requires thinking outside the box. Smart people can see things from different perspectives and excel at problem solving, as well as being good at turning their ideas into reality. Number 2. Natural Curiosity Really smart people are generally fascinated by continuing to learn new things and are therefore aware that they have gaps to fill. They know that they don't know everything. They're not afraid to learn new things and they don't stop at looking only at the superficial side of things. Instead, they try to dig deeper to get more information about it. Number 3. Ability to be humorous Several studies have shown that having a good sense of humor and being able to joke about your own weaknesses without always taking yourself too seriously is a great sign of intelligence. Humor and intelligence are directly related. In fact, it's been found that comedians in particular score higher than average on IQ tests. This is because humor involves not only processing information, but also finding a different point of view on this information and a perfect timing to tell the joke. Furthermore, it requires greater verbal intelligence. This unique ability, along with their presence of mind, allow them to convert even the most insignificant circumstances and things into something that will make us laugh. Number 4. Open-mindedness. This is, in my opinion, perhaps the greatest identifying mark that distinguishes intelligent from unintelligent people. Open-mindedness. Too many people take pride in what they believe and often associate their sense of self with their rigid point of view. Failing to interpret certain situations from a different perspective, often lacking objectivity, even in the face of evidence. Being open-minded is the exact opposite. This does not mean being gullible or easily influenced to change one's views, but it means not being afraid to explore new concepts and ideas. If there's a single common denominator of mentally closed-minded people, it's probably to have traveled too little or to have interacted too little with people from other cultures. Unfortunately, living locked in your own small circle of friends without ever exploring or learning about new realities does not help open your mind. Number 5. Loving Solitude Smart people need their time away from the world to recharge. This doesn't mean that they hate people, but it does mean that they like to have time to themselves to reflect, brainstorm, study past experiences, and plan their next move. They understand that the more time they spend socializing, the less time they'll have for themselves and their ambitions. Of course, they have friends and family they value, but they also need alone time. Number 6. Adaptability and a sense of responsibility There is a category of people who does nothing but complain. If you, like me, still use Facebook, then take notice of your friend who today is complaining about this or that politician, and rest assured that that same friend tomorrow will complain about his or her employer, next week will complain about people, next month about the referee who caused their favorite team to lose, etc., etc., etc. In short, everything that goes wrong in his or her life is always someone else's fault. This inability to take responsibility is dictated by a lack of self-consciousness and one's individual inability to adapt to changes and new situations that may arise. For example, if in the workplace he's been doing his job the same way for 10 years, 
and now he's asked to do it in a different and more efficient way due to the introduction of a new innovative program, rest assured that he will find a reason to complain. Ugh, damn progress. If you don't want to burn precious IQ points, I strongly recommend avoiding these kinds of toxic people whenever you can, both at work and in your private life. Number 7. Ability to recognize one's shortcomings As mentioned earlier, self-awareness is key to self-improvement. People who are too proud will have difficulty admitting their flaws, and this will be a problematic obstacle to overcome if they want to grow and improve themselves. Before you can solve a problem, you must have the ability to analyze it objectively. Intelligent people do not tie their self-worth to their ego, and in this way find it easier to accept their mistakes and move on. Being honest with oneself and others is an admirable character trait and shows high intelligence. Number 8. Strong Identity Intelligent people have the wonderful gift of self-awareness. This means they're connected to their psyche and know their value, their strengths, and their weaknesses, goals, and ambitions. This does not mean that they think they are perfect, rather the opposite. They accept their insecurities instead of pretending they are not there, yet their sense of self does not waver just because they have weaknesses. Smart people work on these to fill them, while at the same time, they continue to develop their strengths. Number 9 having various interests. Smart people like to cultivate diverse interests. They have hobbies they prefer, but they don't shy away when it comes to trying something new. And they might even get sick of doing the same things over and over again faster than the average person would. They tend to cultivate different projects and interests at the same time. While many people look for ways to pass the time, smart people will be focused on making the most of the limited time they have being aware that every minute lost is gone forever. Number 10. Sensitivity to others' feelings Intelligence is not only determined by a high IQ. Emotional intelligence is equally important and plays a significant role in achieving quality, successful relationships, and overall happiness. On this channel, you can find several videos where I talk about emotional intelligence. I put all the links below in the description in case you'd like to learn more about this topic. A well-developed emotional quotient enables you to cope with stress and helps you understand others better, allowing you to be sensitive to the feelings and emotions of the people around you. It also allows you to respond appropriately to their needs. In fact, empathy is one of the most important elements of emotional intelligence. So now, tell me, which of these 10 characteristics do you think you have and which ones do you feel you need to improve? If you like, let us know by leaving a comment below the video. If you enjoyed the video, I suggest you check out the video The 9 Types of Intelligence that you can find on this channel. If you haven't already done so, I invite you to subscribe to the channel and activate the notification bell. Thanks so much and have a great day!